Hi, my name is Chris Bacuro. I'm really excited about this course, Year-End Planning for Businesses. So year-end planning for businesses is very interesting as we're at the end of 2024 and walking into 2025. Obviously, uh, this was an election year, so there could be a lot of changes coming up, but also, especially for small business owners, which are our clients, or a lot of our the core clients, the changes to bonus depreciation are very important to understand when it comes to advising clients. We also have the Secure 2.0 Act, which may changed um, retirement contributions and planning for those small business owners or maybe people that have employees. Um, so those are really two of the things that you have to be aware of. And we're also going to talk about bonus depreciation. Like I said, that bonus depreciation percentage is changing each year. The sunset of the Tax Cuts and Jobs Act is upon us in the interplay between that bonus depreciation and the Section 179 deduction. We all um, take a lot of continuing education and I want you to walk away from this course with first of all confidence, confidence that you are the trusted advisor for your client. Also, hopefully you're taking away at least two implementation ideas, things, you know, we're going to go through a ton of information, case studies, tax strategies, pricing ideas. But what I really want you to do is take away two things that you didn't know or didn't know a lot of before you were part of this course that you can take and implement right into your tax or accounting practice because takeaways are the most important thing. Ideas are cheap, implementation is valuable. So I want you to take away confidence and at least two implementation ideas for yourself and your client. You walk into the end of 2024 and into 2025 with that confidence you have those tools.